Epic Mimic map. And I got to give a shout out to Dutch that uh, put a video out on this in regards to this massive wave of energy that you see that is being picked up here as it hits the Earth. And not only can you see it here on the Mimic map, but what's interesting is over at Space Weather right now, they're saying auroras, no sunspots required. And a lot of people out there believe that CMEs have to be impacting the planet to cause auroras. But the fact is, is that that's not the case. All it takes is energy particles. That could come from a wave of energy that's incoming. It could also come from a solar stream from, say, a coronal hole. But if there's no coronal hole winds and there's other energy incoming, it's going to cause this. Now, the poles, mysterious. I talk about it all the time. The North and South Pole and the auroras that are let off in some of these areas are unique in color and in size to both poles, depending on what kind of energy is impacting the poles. But with this event, you can see there is a massive repercussion here as whatever wavelength this, this uh, was picking up on, it caught this energy hitting the earth. And you can see it's just absolutely massive. Now, I'm going to leave links in the description box. Make sure you check out Dutch's video. He shows how here in the past couple years, there's been X flares. And when the X flares hit the planet, there's anomalies as well. But even from an X flare, this anomaly puts it to shame. This is just a massive wave of energy that is coming over the planet. And I talked about this a couple weeks ago in regards to this unknown burst of energy, wave of energy coming toward Earth. And this could be the effects of just that. Like I said, no sunspots, anything of that nature. And we've also seen picked up off of these maps, uh, them doing other geoengineering, weather modification. You could see the islands sometimes emanating in their little stations out in the ocean, emanating these rings that were affecting the atmosphere. And with HARP, what they do is they hit the upper ionosphere with heat. So you're going to see this. You're going to see the reflection of what they're doing, the frequency and everything, come through and bleed through on some of these maps. And like Dutch said, it's unintentional. They never expected this to happen and hoping that guys aren't sitting around seeing these little things. But we are. And it's happening. And as of right now, this is one of the biggest anomalies I've ever seen from a wave of energy come through and show up here on the mimic maps so interesting indeed we'll keep an eye on it here and see if uh, there's any changes uh, if it continues also keep your eyes peeled for more videos been hemmed up here as of late uh, on the road without a power cord I'm back in business now hopefully also look hopefully go live from the drone so stay tuned